Hi everyone. Uh, good afternoon. Welcome back to the Tech Talk Talk channel. Uh, so this will be the fresh start to the what exactly web methods and what is the integration. So this series will continue with the all the stuff related to the web methods. Uh, so this is the first video. Uh, in this will cover all the introductory part. Okay. So uh, let's begin to the introduction. So what exactly web methods is? web methods is uh, actually it's a powerful middleware tool what exactly middleware tool middleware uh, yesterday i explained in the introduction the video that uh, uh, middleware means we can connect to application and to organization with the help of web methods it's basically integration of two uh, apps or uh, two organization you can say that so it's a uh, powerful middleware tool uh, it's developed by software ag company and the latest version for the web method software ag tool is uh, 10.17 okay so uh, so this is exactly what web methods is and uh, why do we use web methods okay so why do we use this web method to automate the processes suppose uh, whenever i receive a message on teams so it engineers uh, mostly use the teams or slack uh, uh, platform to connect with the clients or uh, internally so whenever uh, so suppose if anyone aware of this uh, automation thing uh, i mean whenever a build is taken from the code and whenever it's deployed on another server so some system will trigger like whenever the system is triggered another action should happen so this will be automation to automate the processes whenever the input is received we will process that data we'll do some modification or we'll extract some fields from that and it will uh, send to the input of another application so like this we can automate the processes by using the web methods flow services are there triggers are there so each and every part i will cover in the next videos okay uh, by using web methods we can manage apis we can secure the api we can use or technology with standard uh, authorization we can use like a password okay so basic tokens we can use to uh, secure uh, to secure the apis okay so by using uh, web methods we can do all these stuff okay uh, now we'll move so introduction is cleared uh, what exactly web methods i have cleared that will go through the key features of web method okay i have prepared this flow chart uh, this is a basic flow chart okay you can look, i'll uh, share the link of this flow chart also you can refer this one so these are the main components of the web methods so first and most important uh, component of web methods is integration server now what is the integration server so whenever we develop uh, there will be uh, just like uh, we use a tool like vs tool or uh, eclipse to develop a java code just like that we will have a eclipse uh, based platform to develop a uh, services okay to execute these services logic what is the services means you can uh, combine the logic what exactly you need to do in that particular service so after do, after uh, developing the service you need to execute that service to execute that service integration server plays a important role so whenever the service needs to be executed integration server must be there on the platform integration server will execute the services okay so this is the main block for uh, executing any service or running any service okay the second again this will be the most important initially we were uh, web methods is using broker now broker is deprecated and we are using the um which is universal messaging now what exactly universal messaging you can refer as a, it's a messaging tool i mean uh, whenever a two system needs to be connect by using universal messages like pub sub publish and subscribe model or queuing technology by using universal messaging we can achieve that. i'll cover uh, in depth all these universal messaging integration server now third uh, third component is api management okay what exactly web methods do in api management is first security is important to secure the apis 
second thing rate limiting i'm mean, how many requests a api can consume for a particular minute or hour like that uh, it can manage how many so rate limiting we can use okay and th a fourth uh, component is trading network again this is an important point uh, important component of the web methods this is basically deal with the b2b b2b means uh, business to business transactions so in which two organizations are connect suppose uh, a trading network i'll give a simple example suppose uh, from amazon i'm ordering something okay okay i order it uh, again uh, my, there is my own company okay uh, suppose take uh, techno stock uh, limited so i order some uh, components from uh, amazon okay Am uh, amazon will generate an invoice okay I required that invoice so amazon can send uh, this invoice amount uh, invoice uh, pdf or anything in the messaging format to the uh, techno stock uh, company so this this communication between the two organization used uh, done by trading network in that partner profiles are there to connect the partners partners means just uh, company names and okay i'll cover these topics in depth uh now fifth point fifth component is adapters what exactly the adapter adapters is like suppose you want to connect web methods to the database there should be something like select adapter uh delete adapter update adapter so these are adapters we use to connect database or we uh, to connect with the sap we can use a sap adapter or to connect web methods to the aws uh you can use aws connectors okay adapters or connectors same okay cloud and hybrid integration same i i have explained it. suppose we have to uh web, web methods is present on on, on premises also and uh, on a uh, uh, cloud for a platform also uh, on uh, premises it's a web methods and on cloud it's web methods io so we can connect uh, both uh, on premises web methods with the uh, cloud uh, cloud uh, you know, web methods how can we do that i will explain in another video okay so these are the main components of the web methods okay so why uh, where real time why uh, why use web methods so as i explained all these points so i have explained all these points why exactly you need to use the web methods and where it is used okay what exactly the role of web methods in the IT technology that I have explained you okay now uh, we'll move to the use cases now the uh, one another question you might have that is why to use web methods there is another also IBM Dell boom is there okay so web methods is widely used as per current uh, trend in the IT web methods is widely used it's a scalable also it's a robust okay it's a uh, you can say it's a loosely coupled I mean, you not need to rely on a lot of components to connect to the web methods it's easy to use you can say okay now use cases uh, use cases with real time use cases where to use in finance industry we can use uh, this web methods now which component is mainly used in the finance in finance we can use apis to secure the transactions okay to secure the transactions we can use the uh, apis so in finance industry we can use the uh, secured apis to uh, secure transactions now in healthcare in healthcare we can uh, track the orders okay i mean whatever present in the inventory stocks present in the inventory for that we can use the automation processes if the limit goes below the uh, set limit then we can uh, do some automation or order some stuffs like that we can use in healthcare in logistic also in logistic uh, currently i am working in the logistic only okay so in logistic we can track the orders i mean uh, whenever the shipment is got created now we can track or any ambiguities is there now we can stop that shipment so all these automation we can do using web methods so all these things uh, uh, 
will be the part of this uh, web methods integration uh, i'll paste this link you can just go through it and uh, i have prepared a handmade notes also i'll paste the github link in the comment section you can refer that also so it's uh, interview question answers i have prepared you can just read read that and you will got cleared uh, you will get cleared all the web methods related interviews okay thank you so much and don't forget to like share and subscribe to this channel okay thank you bye